Carla, Carla, Carla. How are you? All right, classics on dirt. Six lap heat races here tonight. Heat race number one and heat race number two. That makes sense if there's two of them, six laps each. Sportsmen, three heat races for them. Big block modifieds, we will have four heat races for them coming up a little bit later on. Don't forget your 50-50 tickets. Morgan is out here. So is Rachel, Hannah, and Lauren. First prize is the money. Second prize, two general admission tickets to the land of uh, to the Legends reunion on Sunday, August 11th. And then third prize, two tickets to the Albany Saratoga Speedway for the September 21st Super Dirt Car Series event. As the Classic Sunder make their way out onto the speedway. Blast from the past here tonight. Our first heat race, six laps the distance. Jim Hillmeyer out of Penyan, New York in the number 11 machine. Frank Blanchard out of Fort Hunter, New York in the 58. Phil Barkins out of Dover, Delaware in the 21 junior car. Craig Chisson in the 111 out of Penyan. Steve Tanner out of Richmond, Missouri in the double X car. Tell you a little story about Steve Tanner in the double X car. He was in the military, served our great country, used to get all the racing papers sent to him for him to read. He read about this place called Weedsport Speedway. Always wanted to race here. Well, now he can. Him and his wife on vacation from Missouri decided to come on out east and do a little racing. So Steve, first time here to the Weedsport Speedway, and he is going to run here tonight with that double X machine. Dave Farney. Up on the flag stand. He's a blast from the past. He's also the uh, present. <laughs> be careful. I'll be traveling with him in the next couple of weeks. I want to make sure my, my breakfast is still in good standing. Summit Automotive Group, Wheatsport Speedway Pace Car. And our first heat race of the evening, the Classics on Dirt. We are ready to go green. Our good friends from Coca-Cola of Northern New England bringing us tonight's racing action. Jim Hillmeyer in the 11, Frank Blanchard in the 58, Phil Barkins in the 21, Greg Chisholm in the number 111, and Steve Tanner in the double X machine. All right, Mr. Farney, what do you say? Let's go racing as we are green. Classics on dirt. First time down the bed straightaway into turn number three and four. The 58 of Frank Blanchard out of Fort Hunter, New York. Brings it off the turn. He'll lead lap number one with Jim Hillmeyer and the number 111 of Craig Chisholm right there. Chisholm on the one on the top side looking to make something happen. Steve Tanner, he read about Weedsport. Now he's racing Weedsport. It's a very familiar looking car for some reason. I don't know why. As they work their way off the turn, hang on to it, Mr. Tanner. The double X ride riding back there and forth. As Frank Blanchard brings it off a turn number two with the 11 of Jim Hillmeyer holding on to the two spot. Working their way down into turn number three and four. Chisholm right there in third and here comes Tanner. Rounding out the grid is Phil Barkins in the number 21. Everybody clean and green, back stretch, they dance.
working it through turns number three and four. The 58, Frank Blanchard. The 11 of Jim Hillmeyer. The 111 of Craig Trism. The number double X of Steve Tanner. I guess we'll call him the 20 car for Roman numeral sake. And the 21 of Phil Bergens as we complete the fifth circuit one more time around into turn number one and two. Blanchard takes him down the back straightaway. Car length advantage right now as they work their way into turn number three and four. Off the turn for the final time. Hillmeyer closing in, but he can't catch him as Frank Blanchard will pick up the win. Hillmeyer second. Chisholm third, and Tanner will finish in fourth with Bill Barkins completing the field. Our heat race number one goes to the number 58 of Frank Blanchard out of Fort Hunter, New York, picking up the win in that six-lap qualifying run. Heat race number two. For the classes on dirt, we'll be rolling trackside here in just a moment. On deck, we are going to have the Sportsman, or make that the uh, Dirt Car Series Modifieds. Big Block Modifieds will be up next, followed by the Sportsman. Classics on Dirt, Stock Car Club, heat race number two. Carl Weichenthal, the number 46 out of Dundee, New York. We'll start on the point next to him. Out of Dundee, New York, Mark Shank in the number five. Row number two out of Seneca Falls in the 37X. This is Ed Lawrence and next to him. In the number 56 out of Horseheads, New York, is Bob Johnson. Row number three out of Clifton Park in the 03. That's George Palmer out of North Tonawanda, New York. In the 41 is Tim Natalino. Rich Appleby out of Port Byron, New York in the number one. And Justin Shank out of Dundee in the number six car. Heat race number two, six laps the distance. Classics on Dirt Stock Car Club. Up off the turn, they will ride. And it will be down the back straightaway for the first time. In the corner number three and four. We've got a couple of them slicing and dicing, but it's the number 46 of Carl Weichenthal with the advantage as Mark Shank right there for a second, but for how long as he looks to look to the inside with the number 56 of Bob Johnson giving chase. Now Shank to the inside of Weichenthal as they race their way off at turn number four and your new leader will be the number five of Mark Shank into turn number one and two. Bob Johnson follows him through. Weichenthal back to third as the sixth of Justin Shank fourth. Rich Appleby up to fifth. Followed by Ed Lawrence, the 41 of Tim Natalino. And the number three of George Palmer as we are halfway home. Three down, three to go. Racing their way down the back straightaway. Mark Shank in the number five, the 56 of Bob Johnson. Working their way through turns number three and four down the front straightaway. Here comes the six car of Justin Shank. Looking to get underneath the Weichenthal 46. Looking to grab the third spot. He'll do so by a half car length as they head into turn at number three. Off of corner number four, white flag is displayed for your race leader, Mark Shank in the number five. Rolling it off the back straightaway and down into turn number three. The 56 of Bob Johnson giving chase, but he's going to run out of time and real estate. Who turns number three and four. Shank will pick up the win for heat race number two. Bob Johnson second. Justin Shank third. Carl Weichenthal fourth. 
Rich Appleby fifth, followed by the 41 of Natalino, the 37 of Lawrence, and the three of George Palmer will complete the field. That wraps up the heat races for the Classics on Dirt Stock Car Club. As coming up next, we are going to have the first of four big block modified Super Dirt Car Series heat races. Eight laps the distance, five qualify, top three to the redraw. So if it's top five, we'll qualify three to the redraw. And this is how we will set them up for you. On the pole, we are going to find in car number 5H, he was the fastest in their qualifying session. This is the Heil driver, Chris Heil. Chris Heil in the number 5H, he will start on the pole. He's out of Oswego, New York. 